In this video, I am going to do the following multiplication. It involves multiplying two rational expressions. To do the multiplication, so all I need to do is factor things out here. Uh, so I'm just going to do it one by one. x cubed plus 64, by the way, is equal to x cubed plus 4 cubed. Remember, 4 cubed is 4 times 4 times 4. 4 times 4 is 16, 16 times 4 is 64. Now, this is sum of cubes. Remember the sum of cubes formula? is going to be a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b times a square minus a b plus b square. And in my context, a is x and b is 4. So it's going to be x plus 4 times a square, x square, minus a b, x times 4, which is 4x, plus b square, 4 square, which is 16. So I'm going to replace this by this whole thing. Then, uh, this cannot be factored. However, this can be factored. So let me show it to you how. x square minus 9x plus 14, which is x square minus 7x minus 2x plus 14. I could factor out between the first two x. That's going to give me x minus 7. Between the second two, I could factor out negative 2x minus 7, which is, by the way, x minus 7 times x minus 2. And finally, this, by the way, cannot be factored. However, x square minus 4, minus 4, which is x square minus 2 square, so I could use difference of squares formula, which is a square minus b square, which is a plus b times a minus b. That gives me x plus 2 times x minus 2. Now, I have all these factors. This one, this one, and this one. I just plug it back into the given problem. So, instead of this, I'm going to put x plus 4 times x square minus 4x plus 16 divided by x plus 4 times x square minus 9x plus 14 that factors to x minus 7 times x minus 2 divided by x square minus 4 that factors to x plus 2 times x minus 2. Then the last thing is x square minus 4x plus 16 which, by the way, is this term. Now you can see there will be a lot of cancellations that you can perform. Um, x plus 4, x plus 4 cancel out. x squared minus 4, x plus 16, x squared minus 4, x plus 16 cancel out. Then x minus 2, x minus 2 cancel out. Then we are left with x minus 7 divided by x plus 2. And that's your final answer. So I hope that this discussion was helpful, and thank you very much.